you see I'm on high today because I'm going into IKEA today so I'm gonna get some bathroom stuff to dress my bathroom you know your girl dressed it already but you know I want a new look in my bathroom for 2023 so I'm doing my deep deep cleaning and then I'm just gonna give it a, a facelift so guys at work for my Christmas gift I'm not showing them my name but I got a gift card from my workplace with some it's a visa card with some US dollars on it so I'm gonna pay the difference if it goes over so I'm gonna get some stuff to dress my bathroom and Jaden's bathroom so just come with me and just see what we pick today right hold on hold on hold on hold on and those who are new to the channel what they need to do you need to like share and subscribe and leave your comment in the comment section yeah. and guys how oh, can you forget you see the weather behind us look what we have on Ontario this winter I'm telling you it's only 10 degrees out it's a beautiful day the temperature feels just like a good day in Mandeville True. And guys, when you hear 10 degrees, 10 <laughs> degrees, really good weather, guys. It's really awesome. Good the rain, because the at rain this time of rain. year, we're used to seeing like a minus 10, minus 11, True. minus 7. And, and we're it's minus, minus 2. Minus 2, minus 3. If, three. if you're having good weather. Or 8 or, or 0 degrees. And we're experiencing plus 10, guys. Look at what's happening. Feels nice. Yeah, good weather. So, guys, those who are not aware, we are in Vaughan, Ontario. And we would love for you to support our channel by just clicking the like button and make sure to subscribe and comment, comment, comment up on our videos. And guys, we'll be having some lives and I would love for you to join in. Just to come be a part of the family, right? So just come to a Rashi Pig. Come and know so I want to love the home decor too. And all my girls or my ladies out there who like the same thing, see we are going to do it. We are going to do it. Stay tuned. for my bathroom so guys this is for my bathroom I really love this I'm gonna pick this for my bathroom you're gonna give it an exotic spa look exotic exotic I'm telling you I love this I thought you were looking for something with more greenery greenery but orchids are classy plants and I want that look in the bathroom guys they have some nice plants though I'm not really a plant person but I'm just traveling along and getting the ride. And now it's like an eye opener. I'm seeing a lot of, you know, plants that looks amazing. I'm gonna go over there and pick the vase. What do you call these? Vase? What do you call these? Well, my mother said, yeah, I would call it a vase to put the plants in. Our plant holders. You're somewhat confused, you don't know which confused one to choose. I'm confused because I like the gold, guys. But I don't think gold is in again. Put in the gold, let me see. Guys, that's how you have to do it, you know, when you're trying to figure out what to use. It looks good, but maybe a little too shiny. Yeah, because um, gold not really in again like that. People going for neutral, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, and then our bathroom has the grey. So I was thinking, this would be nice, like it's in between grey and the gold. Mm -hmm. So this would be nice, right? China. So it's kind of tame, but kind of classy, you know what I mean? How you like it? We like it still. Like it too. Watch this vase. I have this one. This not bad, but it little um old time. You should say like like a vintage look, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then this one that mirrors like my bathroom exactly. Mm -hmm. So I wonder if it's too exact. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Mm -hmm. So. I think about it. Guys, tell me which one you like. Which one you like? <laughs> the grey one looks awesome, yeah. but a little bit too tame. Yeah, looks a bit too. tame. I think so too. Try the other one again. Which one? The the grey, the grey, this the one. The grey and gold. Yeah, try that one I again. Like Let me see. This one the best. Like this. 
guys leave a comment let us know which one you would prefer but i think wife is gonna go with that one yeah i like this one or i would go with white because you know you can't lose after yeah, white, white is a good but so i like the fact that the that have white some light this component to it and gray on it so this is nice complementing the white Guys, let me just show you this and no rush you're gonna be confused. Look at these ones, they're much smaller yeah, and they're nice as well with different designs. And guys, look at the prices. You must come to IKEA. You just have to know where you want, the type of look you want. This is nice. Four ninety nine five dollars, eh? Oh my god, I love this. But this not match my decor too much. In between, let you have to put the plan in it first. Sometimes it doesn't look like it match, you know. Same no way, my top boy. No, we want this top. Let's see this one. Oh, this. oh, guys, look at this one. Look at this. This is so cute. Look at the details on it. I love this. Let me see how this one looks. Guys, I really appreciate that Jermaine is here with me because, you know, can get a second opinion. What do you think about this? That looks good too. You like this one? Yeah, I really think I should go with the grey with that the gold. looks good too. What do you like? This is this is fitted exactly. The other one was a little big. You see that it was bigger than it? Mm. It fell down. I think this is that this have a classy look. I love this. Right now, I think we have a change of mind. You like the white, right? Yeah, the white looks good. And you know you want a clean cut look. Yeah, so that looks you can't feel with white. Literally. I love this. Guys, what do you think? This is what I'm gonna pick. I'm saying yes to this. How much is it though? Is it's, it cheaper? Yes, it's only $3.99. $4 for the jar. It's not bad. So guys, I'm I'm loving this all over again. But I have one of this in my house already. So what I was going to use this to do is to basically find a jar. I have the exact thing. So I want a beautiful jar to put this in Jaden's bathroom. So I'm not going to buy this. I, I'm looking at jar, but I really can't find a fit for this one. So that's what I'm looking right now. A fit for this one to just give it a, you know, a look. And guys, you don't have to have a bag of money to make your house look really nice and comfortable. The same approach I took from Jamaica. You know, some people go crossroad or downtown. I use the same approach to get my house a particular look. And you can do the same. IKEA have deals from time to time. I think you should take advantage of them. Right? Just do your thing small. You must come up. Think about your overall look that you want to have. And then you just take your time, month by month, with your budget. And just try and achieve them. So if you say, alright, I set aside $20 or $30 per month for my decor. You know that you're going to get a jar. You're going to get a mat. You're going to get something. So guys, I didn't even show you how my gift card looks. I don't want to see the name of my company, but this is how it looks. It's a Visa card that they, they put the money on, you have to activate it and then you use it. So that's what I'll be doing and then I'll pay the difference if it goes over. So for me, I'm happy that they gave me the money because what way, better way to... Just say you love it? freeness. Guys, just tell her that she loves freeness. <laughs> well, I work hard for it, guys. So what better way to spend it than in my house? Because I'm going to be in there for another year, right? Yeah. So or you can buy space. wings. Or you can buy wings. No, no wings for the new year. Cutting down on the, well, not food, but the type of food that we eat. So guys, I'm going to take you al along on that journey as well. You see, no, we only had what from morning, only water. Mm -hmm. so orange, to meat orange. orange. So we're trying the, we call it the fasting, inter intermittent. Intermittent. In, in, inter what? Intermittent. I think it's intermittent. Yeah, that's the word, fasting. So hopefully the weight goes away. I'm tired of it. So let's move along and see what else I'll, I'll find, if I'll actually find a vase to match that thing that I already have. Oh guys, so my theme for my bathroom was white. Yes, believe it or not, I wanted a spa look. But then I came upon this for $19 a piece, right? So you know, we have this color scheme going on in our living room. So this really have an expensive look to me. But then I was thinking, you know, I don't have a long, the piece is not as long to facilitate the bathroom look that I wanted because one of the issues I'm having presently in my bathroom like the normal bathroom mats that you would get my foot is a bit cold when I sit on the toilet so I like to be comfortable there so I wanted mm -hmm. something that's wider and very comfy when I step out of the bath like absorb water and all of that 
so then I saw this color it's big but then yeah the original color that I came for but then I thought it was too pricey because this is what for $50 for this piece so this is how long it is it has That's the corners I rather that one still it's nice I love it because in, you know initially I was using off-white so this is an ideal color for me so this has the corners so it can go around the toilet and all of that and just mm -hmm. give me like a comfy feeling in there absorb and all of that because as you see at the bottom the type of material that's there it absorbs water so this is good and also buy a smaller piece this is for like twenty dollars so um i was thinking i could put this maybe they're matching. Yeah, they're matching, matching, but we're not sure if it I'm can cover sure. the area, so the space. I'm wondering if I should go somewhere else and look before I make a final decision. We have time. What do you mean? But, you know, guys, I would, we have time for it today, you know, guys. I would go with this as a good option, but then my mind telling me, did you look somewhere else? What if somewhere else suits exactly what you're looking for? So I really want to give somewhere a second look before I make a final decision, right? You see them pretty guys, even this. This is a nice color, but how I like to shop. I like to shop for my house as in something that I can use all year round so I don't like to just buy something if I'm buying this I'm thinking how I can use it to rearrange somewhere else so I don't just want to go ahead and just buy this color but this has a it has a good selection for me this one should be at least ten dollars cheaper the taller one I think it should be $39.99 not $50 but you look happy like before you look confused now no I'm not confused I just want more options. I even want to see what somewhere else have before I make a final decision. Who agree? Comment below. We can't just shop, so we need to know what we're exactly we're looking for that we're getting the best deal, especially when your husband on a day off and you know so you want him help. Yeah, so just stay tuned to see exactly if I go somewhere else or what is the case. Do you like what you're seeing? Do you see my vision? Do you like it? Do you like it for your space? Tell me, comment below and let me know what you like from what you don't like or you think it will come true, you understand? But just stay tuned for see. So guys, we're going to order today at Ikea. You said $1. no fast food, right? Yes, that's why we're going to take a hot dog. Okay, so you have the beverages, hot dog, two hot dogs and what's this? And, and, beef, the, and a drink, beef pork. You want drinks? No, but you can take the. You want a drink? No, no want I'm not drink. drinks. I just want a hot dog. I want just buy two of these. Yeah, two hot dogs. That's and then it. What else? You order about to hot dogs. You want tea? No tea. I don't want anything else. So that's it? I have water, yeah. Or the unpaid. So guys, then you pay. Or the unpaid. And then debit or credit. Debit or credit. Okay, and then you tap here. Guys, you see it? Don't show me card in a Right, receipt. but we're going to tap here. Guys, just to taste up the moat. We're on the road. You know, from morning, I ate an orange. So that's your order number, 438. 438, guys. So we're just gonna bite something, yeah? So guys, I'm going for my sandwiches. How much calories is this? I don't know. Any amount? You have to work it off in the gym. No, but you must at least can eat two hot dogs, no? But no, you can't. Without working, one, your body one. naturally needs calories, you know? Right, but... Yeah, think about how much calories you have to count the calories count, you know. Of course, like, you have to keep chat. So guys, tonight I'll be having soup, so not a lot of calories. So I'm checking calories, I'm doing that also. You must be white too, man. Yeah, I have to count calories because I need to go down. Guys, so we have that dog here. This what you do know? you get for a dollar. <laughs> yeah, one dollar each. One dollar each. Yeah, so we'll so. have it with our water, right? Yeah, small food though. You don't need nothing more. All this going to do is start me up right now. No? Of course. Anyway guys, catch Rashi in the... You should be talking, it. this is your vlog, come on. In the other store. Oh, I love these. What do you think about this? 
it's just that obviously it has more fur on it so that's not a good thing does that mean it will keep dirt on it but i really like this one where are we now though we're in winners guys my favorite section of winners the home decor section of it so it's what the marshals they call it I'm yeah not sure but i love this one but the fact that it has so much dust night on it it means that it will keep dust on it and it's harder to wash so maintenance might be a bit harder um it's for 24.99 so it's not bad that one looks like less headache though this one yeah looks like less headache it's more traditional and standard but based on what i saw in ikea i saw i found i found i found something a bit smaller but still of good quality similar quality so guys this is it Ta -da! how you like it i'm loving it i guess the fluffy carpet stuck on you yeah because you know you really want the floor not be wet and you just feel you know absorbent and all of that and this is doing it plus it's washable you can have it in the machine it has the cloth look at the back at the back of it so that's nice it doesn't show dirt as much as much as the color is like this you can use vacuum on these yeah i think so and if you can you if you don't have vacuum guys you actually can use the good old brush and brush it out or wipe it out whites are actually easier to cure than other colors i love this one though i love it too so i think i'm gonna go for two of these i think this giving me the in-between look and it long right. yeah the other one that we Maybe saw in um in ikea yeah yeah well the big one looks good but the other one was too small so yeah, it would be um, able to cover the floor enough or the areas that you're trying to cover I think so yes these now uh they're not as large as the large one in ikea but them you know they're sufficient to cover the space when they come together but guys still pricey but guess what is what you really want and because i got assistance with the visa card of course that's why i'm getting it so i'm gonna buy this as a nice gift for me for working so hard throughout the year so i'm gonna use my gift certificate to get these two so this is what i'm getting guys these two i'll be using for when i step out of the bath the toilet area and also for my face base area so you'll be seeing it so it's the first time when i go see my bathroom come and i'll show you how you can use unconventional looks to put it in your bathroom so here is just that luxury feeling so you feel like at home you're in a hotel right you want that feeling at home all right guys so this is what i'm gonna pick so when i finish dressing the bathroom i'll show you how everything comes together so stay tuned for that you can't miss that so guys i'm excited i got what i came for we have the dream carpet to go in my bathroom 2023 now i go normal with my bathroom this is one of my favorite spots to be so guys don't forget if you haven't remember to subscribe like share and subscribe share this content with your friend and if you actually like it and it was useful to you we are wait and press the like button you like just follow the movement you understand you're a lady and you like the decor and those stuff come and join rashi and wally family why not come on and just give the girls a thumbs up so guys just stay tuned to see how i actually dress the bathroom and just see what the finish look is gonna be and you know just support the movement and Give it a thumbs up, right? Press up the like button, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys, I'll see oh, you later. God. So I'm going to check out right now and just, you know, swipe and go home. That's it for today. That's it. That's enjoy it. the content, guys. Later, that's guys. not it for today you're going in the washroom go clean guys I'm guys i'm not clean. clean no guys i'm not going to clean no you washroom guys rashi is going to clean the washroom tell me if your husband help you with the washroom because mine don't a liar i tell you you know so i clean, clean washroom, clean washroom. i'm going to clean last? it as detailed as you when last but me clean me sweep wipe off the face basin may i'm um, like you're touching up yeah but not just cover the toilet you know if it not look too pretty me take care of that we just not do the detail clean, clean. after yourself and no after and after you too yeah okay guys guys serious well, note still i've got help her with the, with the washroom sure. still you know okay guys but check her out in the washroom guys <laughs> she's gonna touch it up for now all right guys so guys i'm at home now obviously and yes i'm not the number two nor one i'm just gonna clean my washroom and dress it as i was telling you before so that's why you're in my washroom for the first time so i'm gonna just just the bathroom with me right all right so i bought something the other day and i really wanted to share it with you so i'm gonna do my unboxing right here in the washroom right so i got this package from amazon 
maybe a week now but I didn't get a chance to use it this is also good for ladies if you if maybe you know you need extra help cleaning the washroom for men who are single men you don't have a lady to assist you cleaning the washroom you can have this or just ladies if you want your life easier I should think so so I did my research and I said let me try this product and just see how you know how if it cleans the bathroom as good as I would want it right so I'm sharing it with you guys so I'm gonna be selfish I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna use and just cheat the system and clean my bathroom now it for the ladies them are lazy or the man them are lazy you can clean your bathroom every day all day every day right Another thing before you go, I bought two of these, one for my kitchen and one for my washroom. This is the barkeeper's friend. It is very good guys. It can replace the soap and the bleach. So make could just see how well it works in the washroom, right? Wait name, see it here? Barkeeper's friend since, nine, since 1882. Good for stove, oven, good for cleaning bath. All right, so. Excited! Oh, no, it's the magic here, guys. Magic! Cleaning my washroom. No hard work. You see? The easy way to scrub. No bending. No hard work. And guys, you can also buy this for your kitchen. So you can buy one for your kitchen and you can buy one for your washroom. Ready? Go. So, right. So see what comes in the box here. These are the different scrubbers. So I have this for like, I would use this for this part. The part that you want a 360 clean. The brush not feel bad. It feel like a soft, a soft washing brush. All right, you have this one. Kind of ovalish. I'm giving a tree star on a bend my brush. Why not bend my brush? Sure. And then you have this for the crevice and corners, I guess. The small are the tight spaces and then I would say this is the hole that to put on these caps so this one comes with three caps one for the edges one for like a 360 and one like an overall brush and this of course is the charger and um, I would think is the extension for this this is Ooh. And guys, my love set up things, you see. Which I know. So this one. And then this. I guess this are the power section. I wonder if I saw it go. Ooh, let me see. Anyways, my must figure it out today. So guys, this is it fitted up with the one for the corners. I put on this head on it right now. But really what I want the help for is to clean in the bath itself, not the actual bathroom. Because I have my own face, I have my washcloth especially for my face basin. And then I use the Clorox wipes on my toilet. So I don't, I don't mix them, right? So this is just for the bath area. So guys, this is how the power is on it. For this head and I'm gonna see today if it really works like it really takes away grime and so on so guys as you can see this is what I presently have in the washroom don't mind all of this clutter this is in the week clutter I have everything to oil it area everything I put on down put it back under there and organize it but I'm gonna clean up all of this and just dress the bathroom and show you so this is what I have presently and this is what I was talking about. I don't want to have three mats in here. So I really wanted something to keep my feet warm when I sat when I sit on the toilet because then I have to keep moving this mat here when I'm sitting here or move it that way when I'm coming out of the shower. So I really wanted something that could stay fixed. So let's just get right into the cleaning and just see. Oh we look when we finish, right? So guys, I really wanted to get a stand for in the shower, 
but up to now I can't find the one that I'm actually looking for. So I'm looking for the one with the length that I can put in the corner or one with enough adhesion on it so I can adhesive uh, material on it so I can put like my shampoos and so on it near the shower or away from it. Not quite sure but I haven't found the one that I really wanted to do. So I'm just going to go ahead and just get this video done and just show you now. Always stay so when we find it, we can show that again. Like, I literally found what I was looking for. So guys, it's charging now because it, it wasn't fully powered because you have to charge it first. But something that I realized with it, like the it it kind of feeble, so it can do light cleaning, but it can't manage heavy cleaning. So if you're using it like every other day and your bathroom well cleaned, then it would be good. But like if your bathroom well dirty, it'll go cost you free, you know? You need to press on too much. So this is one of the brushes I'm using. The brush is actually good, but the thing that put it together, it kind of feeble. You get what I'm saying? Right, so I have to be going by hand to clean this. So right now, I'll give that thing, I'll give it five out of 10 in review, in rating. It can help you because if it charged, I wouldn't be doing this, but it cannot manage pressure. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So I'm just using my hand to finish up the cleaning. So guys, this is an old school way of cleaning mirrors and glass. Guys, it's clean like a whistle when you use a wet newspaper. Who know this all time thing? Just comment below and let me know if that's how you clean your glass or you use the more modern technique to get your glass sparkly clean. So guys, your girl finished with the cleaning. I had mash up on my ear. But it was all worth it. Look how my bathroom now nice and clean. I'm achieved the spa look that I was looking for. All I need now is a white robe to go in the washroom. All right, guys. So basically, this was I normally have all of these on it because after I wash my face, I normally use a Johnson's baby soap and wash my face. It's very sensitive. So I normally use this. This is my washcloth. This to dry my face. This is my hand soap. You know, we have to use bio oil on our face to keep it moisturized for the winter. Toothbrush and all of this right here. This is what we use regular. And you know, I bought this at Ikea. Very nice, right? With the white dish to complement it. Right? And you know, we have a spray right here. Because you know, so things can get dirty when you do number two. So you just always keep the bathroom fresh. So I have it set on every three minutes. So that's fine and I also keep a fragrance that's very good with just keeping the overall smell good, right? In here I have some of the soaps that I normally use. I use Dove, I'm a Dove user and I like Irish Spring but I like to interchange my soaps that I use so that's there. And you know, pack it all of the other stuff beneath the, the um, cupboard space like my body wash and so on. But I don't want them out because I haven't gotten the thing to go inside the bath as yet. Just to, you know, easy access. So now I just use and put back here. So that's why I bought the storage thing. To just pack away the stuff under here neatly. So these are the things I normally use so I can just get them done. And you know, you have to keep your Clorox wipes in case you have any accident at the toilet. Just keep it nice and fresh and everything like that. Alright, so that's it guys. I'm just going to give you a final look so that you can see 
how the mat actually look because now the mat fill the space so when I sit on the toilet my feet will be warm and I'll be all comfy in my bathroom so just stay tuned and just see what I'm going so guys this is it this is the washroom this is the finished product tell me if you like it try to have everything that's functional here Those are bathing brush and my foot brush. How do you like the mats that I chose? Does it give you that spa-like feeling? Because I'm feeling it, guys. Oh, well, that's my scale. I wear it every morning and every night. So you see my feet will keep warm right there. guys this is my touch of color my peach with gray just to blend everything and these are the mats from a distance the washroom has a small space so I chose white to enable the space to look a bit wider My utility kit with my floss and cottons. That's his beard brush. How do you like it, guys? Hope this inspired you to make your bathroom space look spa-like because that was what I was trying to achieve. And for me, I achieved the look. But what do you think about it? So until next time guys, I'll see you again. Bye.